<coughs> Good morning from the Grove. So today's gonna be a good day, it looks like. Over there, see I put a white tarp. That white tarp is gonna be for that gravel. Yeah. So I'm gonna put that that gravel over there. And then uh, see what happens after, you know. But I'm just gonna I'm just gonna really go slow today. See how it goes. I get motivated first. <laughs> so, and nothing motivates a person faster than having to go to the potty. So, that's a good motivator when you gotta go potty. But that's not the same as getting a load of gravel in a bucket, you know. I don't know. Doesn't have the quite, uh, quite the same motivation, if you know what I mean. Yeah. So, oh, dogs in the neighborhood are barking. People are waking up. Okay. Well, I'm gonna grab a morning coffee, sit here and enjoy the morning, and then uh, I'll get to work a little bit, and uh, I'll show you my progress as we go. All right. Blessings, everybody. We'll talk to you soon. Oh, I got a bit of the gravel moved, and it's cleaned up a little bit over there. Well, lots of gold, though. But anyway, we'll talk it in a bit. A different view of the grove. So, you know, at least you get a different view of the grove, and it's in the shade. So there you go. Hello, my YouTube and the wolf pack. So. There's the side part of all that's the gravel. I did the best I could. I raked it up. It's just this side now. Up that way. But anyway, I got the side done. So that's pretty cool. It looks pretty good. Whew. So uh, how many YouTubians want to see how much gravel I managed to save from the side piece here? I do, I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Oh, you YouTubians are so demanding. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's go look. I do, I do. Okay, okay. We're going. We're going to go have a look. How much gravel I managed to save from that side. <sighs> Whew. Hmm. Oh, the crap, eh? Look at all that. That's from the side part. So, that's quite a bit of gravel. I didn't think there was that much, but that's pretty good. But now I got the big side to do, but not right now. Okay, we'll talk to you soon. Well, you got anything you want to say to YouTubians? What do you want to tell them? We want to tell you to win. Yeah? Okay, that's it? Okay. She says, yeah. Bl blessings be, stay loyal, stay true, and love thy neighbor. That's what she says. Okay. Everybody, how you doing? Uh, you heard from Luna what she had to say. Uh, I was wondering, I thought, well, maybe you guys would like to see the closing prayer uh, for the for for the grove, for the Druid Circle. Um, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to invite you in to, uh, to see how, uh, that's what you do every morning, every night, uh, if you're the owner or the caretaker of a grove. So I thought maybe this would be interesting for you. I don't know. Go to the grove, see you, see you. It's like you do entranceway and pathway. I thank the pathway of life for allowing us to live it and to follow it as we need. I'd like to thank Father, Father Sky for keeping all things together and holding us together. Uh, I'd like to thank Mother Earth for everything that she does and all that she provides. I'd like to thank the Thunderstick and the Sun and Moon Staff 
for giving us direction. I'd like to thank the South, Direction of South, for teaching us to be humble and to teaching us to be courteous. I'd like to thank the Fire Elemental for giving us intelligence, strength, logic, and warmth. I'd like to thank the Earth Elemental for teaching us to be steadfast, teaching us to be appreciative of what we got, and to teach us to hold strong when all things seem hopeless. I'd like to thank the Water Elemental for teaching us leniency, teaching us to be able to share and understand each other's differences, and to try to work together to make one thing strong. I'd like to thank the Wood Elemental for giving us life. I'd like to thank the Wood Elemental for teaching us that even the hardest conditions we can grow and we can learn and become better and stronger. I'd like to thank the wind and the air for giving us the air to breathe and clear thoughts and for helping us to travel our communication through our mind and prayers. I'd like to thank the four colors for teaching us all that they do. I'd like to thank Brother, Brother Sun and Sister Moon, Brother Sun for giving us life energy and Sister Moon for teaching us to rest and learn. I'd like to thank the West for teaching us about others and teaching us the difference between right and wrong. I'd like to thank the ancestors for always being there for us and teaching the wisdom as they handed it down from one generation to the next. I'd like to thank the Family Stone for teaching us that all things are together and all things are family. And if we stand as a family, we become like stone. I'd like to thank Grandfather for all your teachings, all your love, and all your understanding in helping me get through this life. And I'd like to thank Ariel for all that you do and all that you see. I'd like to thank St. Michael, Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, and Raphael. I'd like to thank the North for always being the first, teaching us no matter how hard it gets, we always come out survivor, teaching us to be stronger and enjoying life. I'd like to thank the Four Winds for allowing us to, for allowing us to communicate with the spirits and letting the spirits communicate with us and to remind us with the man symbol that spirits and man are always one. I'd like to thank you. My hawk totem, and my wolf totem, and my cougar totem. And my animal totems will teach me all things. I'd like to thank the East for reminding us that we ourselves are East and to look inside when we have trouble. I'd like to thank Brother Melting for teaching us to stand firm and stand in what we believe. And I'd like to thank Sister Water for teaching us that sometimes Sometimes we have to compromise. I'd like to thank the girl for everything you do. See ya, see ya. Thank you for allowing me. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I don't know if you did or not, but anyway, that's how you close it and you open it every morning and you speak to each one um, about something that they do. Um, that keeps it charged and, and keeps your mind straight, you know, and clear. <laughs> and clear. Um, Oh, something else. Uh, what are some of the main fun Here's one of the main functions of a grove, okay? Is to be inviting for people to come in. And uh, one of the main things it's used for is if you've uh, got negativity surrounding you or you feel negative or anything like that, it removes negativity. So you, when you enter the Drew, you say, uh, Hello, Drew. May I enter? So you see you come in and say, I am full of negativity or there's negativity around me. Please, Drew uh, Grove, could you remove this negativity from me? And poof, there you go, done deal. Um, yeah, so that's one of the main um, one of the main things that a, that a grove is for. Uh, I mean, of course, there's like ten things, but that's one that uh, everyone can relate to, is because everybody has negative days. If you go to a, a grove, anytime you're near a grove or anything like a grove, you can say, "Please remove this negativity from me." Um, you can do that. 
and any holy ground, cemeteries, any, any holy ground you can ask to have the negativity removed. So there you go, a little, little thing for you. Well, that's it for today. Oh, maybe not. Do you guys want to see what I did with the, with the gravel? Yeah, I do, I do, I do, I do. So demanding, so demanding. And do you want to see how much gravel uh, we got? Unbelievable. Yeah? Oh, okay. So uh, we'll do that, and then I'm, then then we'll close this off. So until next time, talk to you later. But I'll just go show you the uh, what I did today and the gravel. Okay. Okay. So I got all the gravel from here. I see it's all over there, and I cleaned up all the side here. See, got all that gravel done, and the front part I got up to there. So there's just that gravel left to do, and I got that done. And uh, whatever I happen to miss, screw it. <laughs> I think I saved enough. I did as much as I could. Uh, but I gotta get all this stuff yet. But if I missed any, it's gonna stay there. Uh, so let's go see this little pile. Walk on your own feet, Luna. So there's my pile of gravel. That is one huge pile of crap. That's what they said on Jurassic Park. That is one huge pile of crap. Anyway, so that's what I got done uh, from the front part of it. So there you have it. All right, so I'll talk to you all soon.